how do you tackle them strategically <laughs> with your calculator especially so let's see you know that any equation is calculator evaluation calculator you are free just apply the laws now evaluate what you see on the board you see it leaving your answer in prime factors leaving your answer in what prime factors so you can choose to use calculator then you convert the answer to prime factors or you follow the procedure so let's try the two calculator keyboard you know how to pick your keyboard now okay so shift what root has it come it's not three times root it's cube root take note so it's shift root it will come then you see that he has put it in bracket do the same and it's even advisable when you are doing any operation hmm, and expressing like this and the numbers in the root hmm, are not in brackets please open your own bracket close your own bracket this is an advice when you take it it will help you <laughs> I'm advising you all right put it in brackets if he doesn't do so it saves you because sometimes it's wrong sometimes it's right depending on the data so to save yourself put them in brackets are you okay thank you for taking that advice so bracket 3 to the power 6 so 3 power 6 as for these things basics you know them already now for now close your brackets Sorry, type five times five to the power three, five power three. I put it there. Then, when you open a bracket, make sure you close it. I got 45. He said, leaving your answer in what product of prime factors. You know, prime factors, if you have what real number system, you saw how I did a division ACF, LCF. They may ask you to use product of prime factors in doing your work. So, what does it mean? Prime factors, they are the name sounds prime so you divide whatever number you are converting using only prime numbers and you know prime numbers go two three five seven eleven now it's not a prime number <laughs> take note it's a odd number you know it all right prime numbers have only two factors but nine has one three and nine itself as a factor so it's not a prime number 15 is not a prime number so from 11 you go to where 13 on and on and on so use only these numbers to divide the number to get prime factors. So let's go. What number can divide 45? Which of the prime numbers can be? Two cannot be. You know it. Two is an even number, so you cannot divide it. So three. Let's use three. Or the one that is more convenient to you, you start with it. If you think five is okay, you start with five. Right? But let me use three. Three. Three will divide four. How many times? Once. Remember one. You put the remainder in front of the next number. It gives you what? Fifteen. What number again? Three. Three will divide this for how many times? Five. So I get three. How many are the threes? Two times five. One. That is the answer. Which one is that? Option A is the correct answer. That is the way for it. But using uh, paper two, right? What do you do? We saw that when you have root, the root comes out as what well, power. So this can be written as into bracket three power six times five power three. Or into bracket raised to the power of one over three. I know that we have come to another property who says bracket multiplication. So this is multiply each of them inside. So you get three to the power six times one over three. The second one is also five to the power three times one over three. This cancels that. This cancels that. Get three. So three to the power of two times. This is one one. One times one is what one. So you get the same answer. But objectives, the advice is I think you can apply this, then you divide, or whichever way, you go by your own way. The one that is more convenient to you. Hallelujah. Amen. Let's go. Question 2. If 2s to the power that equals that, find n. This equation, solve it with calculator. It's possible to make sure we get this present. Look at it carefully. This is equal to that. What is this? What can we do to this to, to get positive? Inverse. So this means that you agree? Good. Equal to x. Our aim is to get this. So this is like over one. Two equation cross multiply. Make this one the subject. You get your answer. So this is multiply that I get what? 2 power n 